You guys know something different? Fully planted. Well, as full as humanly possible. Welcome back, everybody. In this video, this is the part two of the two-part series of me finishing, completing this tank. Those of you that missed the hardscape setup, click on this link right above my head. Everything that you see in the tank are plants that I propagated myself in one of my other tanks or plants to trade it for. So essentially, I spent no money on any of this. So in this video, we're gonna go over every single species of plant that I have inside of this tank. And then we're gonna get to planting, show you the positions of each one of these plants and after that we're going to beauty shots so hopefully you guys will enjoy this video and we'll see you at the end In here, in all the little small pockets, I have Monte Carlo, right? In between little crevices, I also added um, dwarf hair grass. Dwarf hair grass, a little bit here. I have these pogos, pogo stamen, I think. Helferi, Helferi. Um, and of course, on all of the wood, I have Epiphy plants, all the way from Anubis non appetite to, I don't know what Busa Philandra that is, uh, Anubius Pinkto, uh, Nubius Golden, Golden, more Nana Petite over there. Just bits and pieces sprinkle all across. Ariel's Vietnam, and I can't pronounce that. Filled in quite nicely. Also have some Hydrocoto Verticolata, along with Hydrocoto Japan, uh, right there and right there. Hygrophila Pinnidifida, little bits and pieces that I propagated. You can see a little bit right there, a little bit right there. Weeping Moss, kind of sprinkle around, attach onto the wood pieces. And in the background right there, I got Laguidia Super Red, add a little pop of color. And in this bunch right here, I have Java Fern Needle Leaf, Bobitis. Oh, let me get rid of that ring. It's kind of cool in a way. All right, guys, I'm back. That ring is gone. No, the ring is still there. All right, guys, that ring is officially gone. What I want for the Bobitis is for it to come out the surface of the water. I think that would be kind of cool. Rotala Mini Butterfly. So before it was a white background. Now, see, I could put my hands behind it and you don't see it because it's a mirror effect. So from the side view, the tank looked much more open, much bigger. Oh, one more thing right there. That is a Laguidia White. It wasn't doing too good in my other tank, so I kind of threw it in here and it's actually doing better. It'd be cool to fill in this little crevice right here with a whole bunch of LaGuardia Whites. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Hit like if you like this video 
If you don't like this video, hit the like again so I know you absolutely hate this damn video. All right, let's go to B-Row.